Hi everyone, this is my Cobalt Seal run on Press Siege 20. For this settlement, I'm playing with the Fertile Grounds modifier, which adds fertile soil all over the map. Enjoy! We can't get, we can't get unlucky twice in a row. We, we still won, so unluckiness is something that we can handle, or we weren't actually that unlucky. I don't know. The only modifier that's in range is this fertile ground, and there's no reason not to take it. So I'm going to take it. Uh, glades have an increased chance of including fertile soil. And it says plus 60% on the icon. It's a big number. And this is the coral forest. It's got a normal amount of fertile soil. So, uh, normally, meat trees are pretty good on this map. And getting, getting farming going is not the end-all be-all, but on this map it is. So we're going to take... The plantation, because it's cheap. I'm gonna bring some packs of provisions. Actually, amber is cheaper. Let's just take amber. We'll make packs of provisions out of our plantation. Uh. Oh, and what caravan are we taking? <laughs> I should look at that. We've got lizards. Not a very tempting spread. Foxes and humans. A bit more tempting, but not much more tempting. Or beavers and, and foxes. Which is kind of tempting. It starts with amber too. Which means I don't have to bring amber. But that doesn't mean much in the grand scheme of things. It means I can bring training gear. If we take this crew. If we take this crew... Uh, because the human starting ability is find fertile soil, and we're playing on a map that is just 60% more fertile soil than the, the average map, uh, I'm feeling like the human bonus is not going to matter. Otherwise, I would totally just pick this. Let's go with that. Start with, start with a little amber. Start with a little fabric. It's not bad. You can bring training gear. Or, is there a world where we bring scrolls? I don't think so. Or tea. Tea is better. Tea is better. And that's it. That's all we're bringing. <laughs> I'm not spending my reserves. <sighs> now, if I... Just before I hit embark... What if I bring the training gear delivery line and vegetables? Not a big deal. And our mysteries for this map. Gain five sea marrow for every five coal produced. Amazing. Uh, does this map have coal? I think it does. If this map has coal, that's amazing. If this map does not have coal, I hate this. Uh, gathering speed decreased by 50%. That sucks. Resources you sacrifice in the hearth are burn 40% quicker. Okay, that's that's fine. Uh, we need to provide coats for the group. And villagers have a 20% chance of destroying the yield with each production cycle. That sucks. But... I, by this point, we probably are going to have a way to mitigate that. This this one hurts, though. Minus six resolve during the storm. Oof. Anyway. Oh, cool. We got, we got exactly what we needed right here. Oh, and <laughs> we have the kiln. That's 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 a that we gotta pick that for sure. And the greenhouse. This is the one map. This is the one modifier where maybe the greenhouse is not necessary. And then we can go with Smithy and cross our fingers. Does okay, does this map have coal? I mean uh, not coal. Copper ore. It does not. Smithy. 
Oh, wait a minute. This map has a uh, crystallized dew on trees. Is it the meat trees? It is the meat trees. Amazing. Right, get you started, uh, and we would like to make food for the time being. Meanwhile, the rest of us, let me just spin around and get a little dizzy. Let's uh, chop our way towards that uh, geyser. We absolutely want to get that kiln. Ooh, root delivery line. That uh, very much puts us in the comfortable position when it comes to food. All right, we're not interested in anything fancy. We're not gonna. We're not gonna open a glade. We don't need to. You can take it slow. Just gonna chop wood. Uh, I'm thinking we're gonna take the smithy. I'm 99% sure we're gonna take the smithy. But there's no rush. We, we aren't gonna get any value out of the smithy for quite a while. And since we have a plantation already, it's time to start making some goods. Absolutely. Okay. Now, a one-star brick recipe is not amazing. It's not good enough that we can just say, cool, we're going to switch to packs of building materials, bricks and be very happy with that. Oh, I forgot to build roads. Whoops. Let's go ahead and do that right now. The fact that this is a drizzle geyser is pretty sweet too. Uh, that, do that does also put the greenhouse back in the running if we really need it, but I don't think we do. The only reason we would take the greenhouse is for... Uh, I don't know. I can't think of a reason why we take the greenhouse. Not, not with our current setup. Uh, I should be chopping towards this. Uh, foxes are going to hate me. That's okay. Can we build? No, we can't. We have to build shelters. I will... Get folks building. Since we have this, we're comfortable with food. Since we have this, we're comfortable with fuel. Like, we're really comfortable with fuel. It's, it's a little crazy how comfortable we are. Because of this mystery. We're going to be getting sea marrow, and sea marrow is just sick. Uh, I want to build a trading post as well. And I need... Sure, you can be our new <laughs> firekeeper. Oh, uh, turn off coats. No coats. What is our 
year two. Uh, 40 water, so wood production plus one is pretty good. But we've got fuel solved already. I don't think we need this. This is uh, gravy. This is some gravy. Actually, I'm, I'm tempted to reroll this because this doesn't matter early game. And it'd be nice to pick up a perk that matters more early game. Uh, each neighboring town offers plus two more trade routes, but no trade trade will have your settlement. No, we're not doing that. Uh, for each 10 completed trade routes, all houses will have room for one more person. Sure. In the interest of not re-rolling that, it's not great, but in the interest of not re-rolling that to death, I will take that and then complete three trade routes is easy. Delivering packs of crops, I hate doing that. Fox Resolve is going to happen, so I'm going to pick that. Uh, and this is, this is always a toss up. Whereas discovering three glades, it's easy. Salvaging a, a building, easy. And the rewards here, plus one a stone yield, heck yeah. I love it. Uh, wear coats. If we wear coats, we get reinforced needles. Yeah, this, this is good. This means we don't have to worry about picking anything for fabric. And then if we burn a bunch of cysts, which is going to happen. We've, we've picked a bunch of objectives that are going to happen, basically. Uh, we're playing extra slow. Let's switch over to coal power. Okay, how can we optimize? Water, nope, no water. Uh, we can finish building these houses. And we need to start selling goods. Turn that off. As soon as drizzle is over, I'm gonna move these foxes over, split them up between makeshift posts, let them finish building, and then stone cutters can. Actually, I hold off on the trading post. And look at that, we got sea marrow. Put you there, put you there, and the last one can build. And because we have fabric, because we started with it, our happy is going to be so happy. Our harpy is going to be so happy. <laughs> Alright, we can't keep, we can't just keep stalling in here forever. We do have to open up a glade. I'm going to do that during the storm to give us the best chance of dealing with whatever's in here. Got a bunch of wood coming in. Turning all of our wood into coal means that we don't have a lot of wood for planks, which is a problem. We do need to we do need to get wood for planks. Don't need bricks, don't need pipes. Unfortunate, but it's the truth. Got you out here. All right, where's my where's my newcomers? Come on. I'm very tempted by parts. That's very tempting, and bricks. That means that we don't have to rely on mining stone anymore to make sure we can build a blight post for year three. And parts are just good. Parts are just good. Whereas this is uh, not that tempting. But there's one more person in this pile. Oh, but that's just, that's just too good. 
We still need bricks. Not bricks. We still need planks. We don't need to be doing this. We'll be better. Get that trading post up. And then let us open the glade. And our first trade route of the game. It's going to be plant fiber. Does it say how much amber I need? Uh, 10. Okay. So that'll get us plus 1, which is a good start. Plus 1 trade uh, standing. Ah, we have fallen foxes. We can either throw tea at them and amber. Let's hold off on the last minute. Or we can just make our foxes sad. And we'll get wildfire essence. Not enough. Not enough to be worth it. But we'll, we will get wildfire essence if we do that. Uh, okay, so 12 plus 7 is 19. And I have to pay 6. So 13. Uh... I should get this started. Oh wow, I don't have much time. Oh. Well, I got I got a bunch of sea marrow. That's that's that saving great grace. And it is light post time. That is not where the blight post goes. Okay. Can't really buy anything. I can sell berries. I can sell crystallized dew. Selling stone is good too. Selling fabric a little less good. I'll sell that. I'll sell that stone. Oh, tea. Yeah, I'll sell my tea. Make sure I don't sell too much. Okay. Silent looting. Every time you open a cache, minus fifteen hostility. I like it. Trade routes. We're getting trade routes, so we're gonna take that. Burn at least eighteen cysts. If we do, we'll get bonus coal production. Now that's pretty good. Are we going to complete this in time? Or are we going to get a blood flower? I think we're going to get a blood flower. Oh no, no unless we uh, burn. Go away. I don't have time for you. Uh, I'm going to pick. No, I'm not going to pick yet. I'm getting there though. Can we pay this? Okay. So we need to burn just a little bit. Is that good? It's, uh, am I spacing out? No, that's good. Okay. It's good by like a few seconds. This is for first dawn. I've already got some amount of money coming. Oh, I've already, I've already solved this. This will be, uh, what is, what is this called? Standing level, standing level one? I'll, I'll let that, I'll let that finish. Uh, we'll turn this in now. Because I need people. Get that smithy. And I don't want a trapper's camp. For one reason. And that reason is we already have a trapper's camp. So press, get in here. That also means we can turn on uh, plant fiber. For fuel, there's no reason to do that actually. Never mind. Just kidding. OK, 
Okay. That didn't update. All right, whatever. It doesn't actually matter. It doesn't actually change anything anyway. I, I could have uh, sent this off at any time. I need twenty amber. It's not gonna be done that way. When will this get done? It's actually important that this gets built at some point. <laughs> uh, please? safe for a while and we have a cashier with a lot of food if we need it I don't know if if we'll need it and if we do win but just keep that in mind has more people. I like that. I need more people. So that I can do that. Do that. Got an extra beaver now. I don't really want to be chopping wood. Now, question for me to figure out. Do I open this now? And then staff foxes in there. I need to figure out some way to use up drizzle water. Okay. Is the only other dangerous glade? That's adjacent to my ancient hearth. This one? Alright. Just swap these around. Harpies will be fine as soon as I build this. selling a part ooh rather not sell plant fiber I'll sell eggs not that many though I really need to rebuild this fuel not great but we're doing okay plenty of margin got a lot of money. We could reduce our fuel consumption. We could buy fabric. I don't think we need to buy fabric or stone. 
Yeah, why not? Yeah. We got money. Uh, reduce hostility. Oh, hostility is reduced by 10 for every 100 time you use 150 units of water and rain engines. That one's... It could be better, but it's still good. Alright, and I would like this to be open, please. So, put a, put a priority on that. We're just gonna use... We're just gonna use rainwater. We're just gonna do it. Game, the game is, is bullying us into doing it. Oh, I never uh, actually told them to chop the tree. 30 seconds. 20 seconds. Alright, what is this? Oh, it's the thing. It's the thing that you need water to fix. Or we could use oil. We don't have much time. Or... Uh, containers. Uh, we could buy them, though. Okay, hold on. I need 30 water skins and 40 oil. Can I fix it with pipes? If I get 16 more pipes, which is not for sale... Is there a way to square this a little? Yeah, like that. So all we have to do is build the Druid's Hut real fast, which is not going to happen real fast, unfortunately. Planks are just at a premium. order I need four more yeah I'll sell that okay now this will explode if I don't get it fixed soon if I need to I can just use parts it's kind of lame but I can do it please don't make fabric I'll, I'll give it until we're at seven minutes. And then I'm going to spend parts. I don't think I'm going to get oil in time. Guess what? It's part time. Let's just do it. Let's just do it. It's fine. Sell some tea while we wait. And then we are completely out of the thing. More people? Come on in. We need f food. No, we don't need food. We need people. Your people. Get in here. Can certainly get food. Now, hostility is gradually keeping creeping up on us. Not ideal. We really should be upgrading this to uh, tier two. One of those. 
Let's get some planks going. No, it was this. If I discover one more glade, stone. Stone is good. Can we get down to hostility? No, we can't. We're in trouble. Major trouble because we can just do this. Hmm. Not minor trouble. That is, that's some trouble. How do we get out of this? Uh, if I build... Okay, if I build another... Hearth... That will... That will naturally solve the problem. I could burn coal... For a temporary fix. I just need more planks. I just don't have enough planks. Come on, kick in, kick in. Don't make me, don't make me, uh. All right. Since we're doing this, we might as well turn that off. this thing that's giving us water. Uh, great. <laughs> that's the wrong water, but... Can we... do something like... Oh, heck yeah. I can fix this. Why didn't that work? Did Oh, because... No, why didn't that work? What the heck, foxes? like a solid start. Yeah. Oh, I need to staff this. Unstaff that. We're tier two now? Yeah, this is a tier two hard. And we got we got blight happening. Okay, next cornerstone. Oh yeah, more food? More food. We can start just selling, exporting food like crazy. Uh, and that's what this objective is, export food like crazy. Yeah, I'll do that. Not selling planks, geez. I'll sell, I'll sell do. I'll sell that. don't really need to be making oil. I'm not sure why I'm doing this. But you know what? I'm doing it. Uh, pull you out of there. Pull you out of there. Yeah. I would like to build another hearth this time. You know, I haven't even looked at what this building is. It's an explorer's lodge, okay. Uh, it is time to open up this geyser.
switch over to oil power. And I never set a limit. Oh crap. <laughs> just 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 constantly make. Just constantly make. It's fine. What's the worst that could happen? Just run out of fuel? Uh you're a bigger group. I need more people. What I really need is better planks. And to get that, I need to start unlocking blueprints. Did I did I pick the wrong tree? Outstanding. Okay, I can't do that. High level of corruption noted. Okay, let's turn this in. Get a new blueprint. Ah, oh, not what I need. It's not what I need, but I'll take it. Hello. Build that up. We'll get some fox houses. Because I need, I need foxes to start. Sell some of that. Oh, whoa, whoa, hold on. I just saw my food is absolutely way lower than it should be. Stop making packs. Was it set to 30? It should be set to 10. Do not need that many packs. Oh, there's only just one stone deposit right here. That's random. All right, you there? Selling oil for money? That is that is what I do. I should really pay attention to who I have staffed where, because I really need to get these houses built. Uh <laughs> very soon. And I can turn on coats just to solve that. Uh, where is it? Need for clothing. Okay. Okay, good, good, good. Cannot keep chopping wood, unfortunately. are a little confused. What's your ideal next blueprint, you think? Something that uses drizzle water. I'm thinking something that uh, also maybe the beanery. Is the beanery use drizzle water? That would be amazing. Come on. Okay. We've burnt our cysts. Increased fuel. Don't really need to be multiplying fuel that much. Oh, you can't make packs of crops out of berries? Oh, whoops. Figured you could. Turn this off because it's completely unnecessary. If we can burn one more cyst, that'd be great. Uh, not the Explorer's Lodge, because it uh, turns out we have one of those already. Uh, the ranch? 
It's a good building. It does use drizzle water, so I'll take it. And what I really need is more wood. I just need it. Less coal, more wood. What have you got to sell? Oh. Yeah. Yeah. That's uh that's a that's a that's a good that's a good one. We'll just buy our way out of this problem. Cause we can. Oh, okay. Lose all fuel upon picking this cornerstone. I don't think so. I don't think so. I have too much good fuel. Gain tools every time the villager leaser dies. Probably not going to matter. Probably not. Do I buy more planks? Oh, you know, it's four more planks. Or she. Uh, I, I, I can't tell. <laughs> Bring in more folk. That's a lot of plant fiber. I know that's a smaller caravan, but that's that's a lot of plant fiber. Put you there. Okay. Next blueprint. All right. This is this is more of what I'm talking about. I don't think we need this anymore. We have bricks already solved. Fabric and planks, those are not the correct ratios. What are our ratios? Okay. We have plus three planks, plus one fabric. So we do not need the workshop. Where's the cookhouse? Skewers and, aha, we can make skewers. Make it from berries. Let's get the ranch up first. Even though it doesn't get us anything. Okay. I think... I think we need to build another blight post if we're doing this. Uh, we can multiply eggs for now. Get rid of this. We do need to be opening up more glades. We've. I. That's. I need to do that. Ugh. Before that, though, we can build one more hearth. Why not? Ooh, bathhouse. We got the tea delivery line, so yeah. That's called winning. Maybe this one. All right, we got the blight swarm. Absolutely, we do need to get second blight post. Put it right here. Let's turn off all the engines. I know, I know it's ticking back hostility, but I don't want people to start dying. Uh, we can sell some coal. We can sell some tea. We can sell some berries. And if we could just not eat roots so that I can 
Roots and mushrooms. Where are we getting mushrooms from? I do need packs of crops. I do need them. Uh, and I think, I think since we have that up, we can dial those back up. We're safe. Nothing can go wrong. We're invincible. We also have a uh, enough tools. We can send in one of these. Minus 15 hostility? Why not? Dang, that's a really good price for sea marrow. Considering we can just print it. <laughs> All right, Blight Fighters. Ugh, come on. I don't really have a good solution for that. Slaughter. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. I need to get beaver houses. That's that's the long and short of it. I gotta make beavers just appreciate. Hold on. Uh, why am I? I'm trying to click on the hearth. I've got too many people here. Not enough people here. This is level one when it should be level two. Fix that right now. up here. Beaver houses. It's a lot of wood, but we got the tech for it. We got the tech. I've got a lot of cysts. Pop. Oh, Sendor, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, that boosts my, my coal production, too. Absolutely need that. Okay. Can print pottery. We cannot print pottery because there's no clay on this map. We don't care about flour. I don't really care about making tea, and I already have incense and biscuits, so let's reroll that. Carpenter. Market. Market for sure, 100%. As soon as we get wood. Uh, oh, I'm, just, I'm burning coal really fast. Is it safe to do this? It is, okay. I uh, lost track of my my coal coal spend, and I hope I don't regret that. <laughs> yeah, luxury and treatment are perfect. Exactly. I am ready to start spending money. Yes, yes. Uh, foxes really like both of these things. Export specialization, that's a good one. We're gonna bring in uh, parts, why not? And we're gonna sell this stuff for way too much money. Just an absurd amount of money. Uh, I just bought that, so I'm not gonna sell it. <laughs> Please, woodcutters, cut me, cut me some wood. Oh, yeah. 
Happy to see some high level against the storm gameplay. Yeah. I would I wouldn't say this is the uh, the toughest <laughs> the toughest settlement. What else? Do I buy fabric? I don't really need to buy fabric, right? I've got a decent ratio here. Oh, 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 oh. Stop using plant fiber. Because we can turn plant fiber into leather. Oh, I need to stop being claimed by this this little one. Right click. No. Okay, I said I was going to open up a glade, so I will. And I maybe need to build a small workshop over here too. Maybe you're right, still some things to pick up for myself. On my way up the prestige ranks. Yeah. There's a couple of breakpoints, I feel like. I think I think I hit my first wall at prestige eight. And it took me quite a few runs before I before I got over that. Is there any reason I would do this? I would want to. I don't want to spawn a lot of blight rot cysts because I don't have anything that benefits from that. I benefit from spending my my water, but I can only do that so fast. Okay, what is this? Barrels and food, and I don't need those, so I'll leave that alone. It was Prestige 10, or whenever the trade price was doubled. Yeah, that one's that one's brutal. Even though, even on Prestige 20, trade is amazing. <laughs> wow, they really want me to sell my wine. I'm not doing it. Okay, I have need of planks. Where are my planks? Uh, and am I going to be in trouble for the storm? I think I think uh, I need to get a little more resolve out of my harpies. And there's a one way I know how to do that. That's not gonna work. Oh no, it, it does. I've got I've got fabric. Do I need to build another crude workstation? Wait a minute. I'll just build the this other building that I've got. The clothing building. Stop cutting. Oh, that's a problem. I definitely don't have enough coal that I can just burn it throughout the whole year. Definitely can't do that. This does not help. I'm gonna burn coal for a little while. Let's turn off using coal to make. Uh, oh, I have the cookhouse. Should really be. Uh, should really be doing that.
Oh, cool. I have everything. Perfect. Resume consumption. And now I just need to find a lot of points. This might be a case where I need to build more woodgun camps. I need to be just focused on collecting wood. Uh, let me get my last camp. Here it is. How are you seeing all your workers in each building? Is it a keybind? It's the alt key. Alt key shows all your workers. Control key shows all your production. Uh, tab shows your engines. I think the Z key shows your corruption. I'm about to run out of coal. That's a problem. We should be able to, to, to get through this. By doing some of these shenanigans. Coats would be good. Parts normally would be good, but I don't think... I'm not thinking that's uh, the, that's not the way out of this. Uh, more leather would be nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, let's, get, let's get cutting. I need wood. Once we have enough wood... I can get up the market right here. I can get up the Explorer's Lodge down here. Are you selling wood? You are selling wood. Wonderful. Give me all of it. I I can I can buy this, why not? Uh buy a bunch of biscuits. Because harpies will push resolve if I do that. And then I'll just, I'll just start, no, I'm not selling my wood that I just bought. I'll start selling tea and not more wood. That's it. Now that is a pretty solid crude workstation. Pretty solid. I don't really want either of these buildings. Tea doctor? Sure. <laughs> I'm having a hard enough time building what I've already got, but... What's the keybind for filling out a building? I see picking a species for a building with alt and then fill it with another keybind. I think it's shift. I'm honestly... Yeah, it's shift. If you hold shift and you click. Okay, we got this building. Uh, I need pipes. Yeah, no problem. Put a harpy in there. And I actually need some builders, so I'll take you guys out. Oh, actually, I don't need builders. I need uh, market folk. Wait, one of these gives me pipes, doesn't it? Uh, I, I, that's, that's probably not worth doing that, but keep that in mind. Okay. Okay, here we go. Time to buckle up. We're going. 
goes. I've waited long enough. plant fiber because we need to start making meat. I'm going to put someone in here. I don't have anyone. <laughs> as soon as I get people, I'm going to put them in here. all pushing and it's the storm. I love to see it. Ah, the beanery. That is wonderful. Can you make... No, nothing, nothing from the plantation can be made in the beanery. The tool shop is tempting. But I think it's the end of the game. Fifty-three people. Where are they? Wait a minute. I completely forgot that I took urban planning. <laughs> oh my gosh, my my buildings have so many spaces. Do I even need these? I do. Not this one. Fiber delivery line. Unnecessary at this point, but why not? Why not? Did we get this built? We will soon, and it can take uh, training gear. And one. Oh, we don't have a. Uh, we don't have money. We don't have enough money. Will we? Not in time. We're one second off. I will take just the wine then. I should be building more, far, more fox houses. A guild house? It's a little really late for that, but... How much is this boosting by? Two. Okay. It's not a lot. It's not nothing compared to what the guild house is going to give us. If we build it before the game ends, which we won't. Spoilers. Oh. 
<sighs> nice. Nice. All right. Pretty smooth sailing from the very beginning. Starting with fertile soil in your in your home is just good. And the, the modifier that gives you 60% more fertile soil. Every single glade we opened up had fertile soil. Every single one, except the the geyser one. Uh, except this one right here. I'm just gonna pause. Yeah. Yeah, it's food food is solved. And then we started we got the kiln in our very first blueprint. Fuel was solved. And this mystery gives us sea marrow for producing coal. Which we didn't even need. <laughs> yeah, it all came together.